Okay. I don't know how I can fucking steal. Crazy? Marjorie? Oh. Nothing. Lady Marjorie is still with the king. I thought you'd want to know. Thank you. Thank you. Mira, look. The other day when you asked Lady Marjorie for help, I only spoke out of fear for her. You I want bitch. to help you if there's anything I can do. Your poor family. I can't imagine how you must feel. Please don't repeat what you heard to anyone. Of course. I never would. Lady Marjorie is always saying how important friends and allies are in King's Landing. Just know, I will be here for you if you ever... Oh, she looks upset. Did he slip in the wrong hole? My lady, I'll leave you to talk. Are you alright, my lady? He didn't use lube. The king was not inclined to offer help for your family. I'll need this mended. Gods. The fuck did it sh Why was the camera shot at a test? He said I was too easily swayed. And he reminded me that I am not yet his wife. I allayed his fear. For now. But it will be a long time before I can ask him for anything with again. With a blowjob. With a, with a blowjob. Nothing I, I said not. could cheer him. He wouldn't even speak to me when I left him. I am so sorry, my lady. I should never have asked you for the king's help. Understand, it was my mother's plan, not mine. I just hope you can find some way to forgive me. Place in blame. As always. Puppy dog eyes. This is simply not compliment. how things are done, Mira. Not in King's Landing. I'm sorry, my lady. <sighs> Soon I will be queen, and maybe then I'll be in a better position to help you. But for now, now we must both be cautious. I must send a raven. I have to warn my family. If you'll excuse That's me. That's a raven. Milady. Who that? Who that is? Begging your pardon, milady. I hope I didn't frighten you. I'm glad to see you. Thank you, my lady. I hope you saw. I was right. Better love story than Twilight. About lady Marjorie and Queen Cersei. I just want you to know, I, I can help you if you'd like, and your family if you're willing to trust me. I hear all sorts of things, things that could be useful for you. How can I trust you? There are spies everywhere in King's Landing. Which is why you must trust me, my lady. You need allies. Hopefully I'll literally no be useful to you. Reason to trust you. Why Sorry, must you trust me? I, I really you must trust me. Please don't despair. Wah! I know people who people who'd be willing to help you. Okay. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Dead ass. Hmm. Where the bloody hell is Duncan? He should be here. Oh, fuck it, no. Now fuck him if he's angry. We'll do without him. And without King's Landing. I know would have been the same either the way. Purpose, but I'm the other guy. He wouldn't fucking show own. up. Your men are ready to act if needed. Sir Royland, I trust you'll keep a level head. Of course, my lord. But the bastard of Bolton can't be trusted to do the same. I can fucking waddle in the fat fucking prick. Isn't this a lovely pile of timber? Not the place. It's a lot of stone, it's actually. Fire. It's made out of fucking Iron stone, you idiot. Is near impervious to flame, my lord. Is it? May I introduce Lord Ramsay of House Bolton, son of Roose Bolton. Although a bastard. bastards. Lord Ramsay has the full authority of Thank the Warden you, of the. That's enough. <laughs> Who is this little boy? Is he lost? Lord Ramsay, welcome to Ironrath. Aren't you the little lord? 
Lord Whitehall told me you were young. <laughs> this. Look at you. A token for the new Warden of the North. Let me guess. Ooh. Forrester Iron. Carved Good guess. Most skilled you craft. fucking great fucking idiot. Ironwood. Doesn't look like much. What do you think? <laughs> Not bad. Lord Whitehill, can your lot do this? Given enough time, we could learn. Given enough time, you could do a great many things. But not this, apparently. Look at that. More Forrester. Lord Ramsay. Fuck off. Come out where I can see you. Force him to focus on the business at hand. What is it you want, Lord Ramsay? What do I want? Everything. Nothing. We'll see. First. Let's see you bend the knee to my father. Lord Bolton. Warden of the North. Words sure. are Where is he? Anyone can say they're loyal. I want you to show me. My lord. Ha! That wasn't so hard now, was it? Here's the thing. Just doing what's right for I my don't family. Care about your loyalty. The crown, however, wants what you've got. Whatever you kind of want to keep my head for a while. For centuries. You know? Ships, shields, chamber pots. Shit. I expect you'll do the same for us. My father has promised as much to the king. You wouldn't want to make him a liar, would you? That wouldn't reflect well on me. Wouldn't mind. No, Lord Ramsay. That's a good little lord. You can't trust a forester. They murdered our men. It was a forester squire who did it. One Whitehill soldier dead. One Bolton. Yet your man lived. Our men are dead. Yours oh, lived. Fuck. Didn't even know I was then meant to do anything. You welcomed then. me into your hall like a proper lord, hoping I wouldn't linger outside long enough to notice your pathetic little army. That sort of insolence from one of our loyal bannermen will not do. So I've come up with a solution that will benefit everyone. The White Hills will be taking control of your ironwood from this day forward. What? What? You iron... fucking what, mate? But... The White Hills are nothing more than up-jump thieves! You can't do that! <laughs> Why not? You know something the White Hills don't? We are talking about trees. You grow them, you cut them down. It can't be that difficult. The White Hills had ironwood, once, but now those hills are bare. Hence the name, of course. They know nothing of how to cultivate the forest. Look at their sigil, my lord. A barren hill. Do you want ironwood for the next five years or the next 50 generations? The little lord does have a point. We'll try this. Lord Whitehill will take half of your ironwood and okay. see who fares better. But my lord... Half of something is better than the nothing you had before. To ensure right, there's no fat prick. trouble. Lord Whitehill will install a garrison of 20 men within your walls. At Ironrath, that we cannot abide. Ethan. They'll help maintain the king's peace. And make sure there's no more trouble. This will cause more trouble, not less. <laughs> not for me. Fucking asshole. You have a man you trust? My son, Griff. Griff will lead the garrison. The seven hells he will. That's. Do make this visit worthwhile. Please, Sir Roiland, don't. Look at this little forester. You're not frightened, 
Are you? Lord Ramsay, please. And you? Are you Lord Ethan's older sister? I'm his twin, my lord. Ah, twins. Well, like the Queen and her brother. Well, <laughs> hopefully not just like the Queen and her brother. <laughs> I never right. had a sister. Always wanted one. Enough, Lord Snow. I have an idea. You'll come with me. You can be my highborn ward. Lord <gasps> Ramsay, that's enough. Do you like hunting? Let her go. She's quite pretty, your sister. We'd get along well. You've gone too far, Lord Ramsay. I demand you let her go. I suppose you can stay. Fucking cunt. Aren't you the brave lord? <clears throat> <laughs> no! What have you done? But I don't want the brave lord. Far too much trouble. Ethan! 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 My lord! Oh, no. Even though you did bend the knee. I think we've come to an understanding. Uh, I certainly feel better about all this. Oh, However, the foresters need to keep their end of the bargain. Stop! Take the boy as your ward. Kill him if they give you any trouble. Lovely meeting all of you. We'll have to do it again sometime. Somebody help him. Um, Fetch the mace so quickly! You brought this on yourself. Fuck. Stop. Don't let him take Stop. me! You will not Fuck. take him! Stop them! Please, Ryan! Please! Let no. me go! Ryan! Do something! Ethan? Oh, my son. Ethan sacrificed himself for us all. He saved Talia's life. He'll be remembered as Ethan the Brave. This house needs a leader. Lord Ethan named me Sentinel. I will lead this house. My sister Fuck. asked me to loyalty to her son, and you did it without flinching. We can't let them hurt Ryan too. We have to stop them. We do not stand alone. There are those who will fight for us. Those who hold House Forrester above all other loyalties. Those who will not stop until Ethan is avenged. Until Ryan is home again, our house will not fall. We will be ready. Nothing comes without a cost, my lady. Are you prepared for what might happen? Well, that was episode one. Of Game of Thrones didn't end as as I expected. Um, thank you for watching. This has been episode one, and um, don't make bad decisions. <laughs>